Hello family, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Angela and on this channel, I create beauty, fashion and lifestyle content and particularly for the woman over 40. Now, if you watch my videos a lot, you know that I do a lot of styling videos. I do some haul videos. I do vlogs every once in a while, but I really, really love the styling videos. And the idea of today's video is to take a very, very basic outfit. Today I have on a black long sleeve tee. This is my all time favorite tee. I have it in black, white, and blue, short sleeve, long sleeve, crew neck, V neck but take a basic black tee and some basic black jeans. These are Levi's. I wanted to have an outfit that it was accessible to everyone. So everyone can purchase a pair of Levi's. They're everywhere. They're all over the internet. So you can easily find some Levi's or if you that's not within your budget, you can find some regular black jeans, but I just wanted you to get some ideas of how to style a black on black basic outfit. So for me, it's a black tee and some black jeans. These are skinny jeans. You don't necessarily have to wear skinny jeans. I have straight leg jeans. I have wide leg jeans, but these are comfortable and I thought they would look great with today's outfit ideas. So I'm going to show you five ways to style this very, very basic outfit. If you like to see what those five ways are, then stay tuned. Now let's get started. So this is look one. I really wanted a monochromatic look and you can easily pull this look together with items in your wardrobe. I have on my over the knee Stuart Weissman boots. I've had these for years. They are so comfortable. They are, they don't have the black heel, but it's a dark, dark brown wooden heel. So it still looks very monochromatic, especially from the front. I have on my jeans, of course, and I use the t-shirt as a layering piece. So it's under my faux leather top. That way I'm going to still be very, very warm. Paired it with my YSL purse for a seamless black outfit. Now I do have multiple black boots that I could wear instead of these. I have some ankle boots. I have some knee high boots and I have some flat kind of flat chucker type boots. So depending on where I'm going, I can put this look together. I could also pair some heels with this if I feel like being a little more dressy, but I really wanted a very comfortable monochromatic look and I could achieve that with this black t-shirt and these black jeans. So this is look number two. And for this look, I use the t-shirt as my primary shirt and the jeans as my bottom, of course. I've paired it with these really, really nice chucker boots. These are from Echo. Got these on a collaboration last year. And my tweed blazer, which is really, really nice. This is a really nice neutral look. So the brown and black are very, very fall and winter like, but they're also neutral. And paired it with my Fendi purse, which is brown and black as well. So it perfectly matches the outfit. And because the purse has gold hardware and the blazer has gold hardware, I paired it with my uh, black belt with the gold hardware and I don't have earrings in, but I would have on gold jewelry. So this is look number two. And I think it looks very, very well. I think this basic outfit that I have underneath, you really can't tell that I have on a basic outfit. I've paired these accessories. I feel very well for a really nice completed casual, but elevated casual look. Now, if you don't have a brown type blazer, you could also put a black blazer on with this and also with the brown shoes, or if you don't want brown shoes, or if you don't have brown type shoes or this particular type of shoes, you can also do a black boot and put on a brown blazer for a similar look. Just mix up your browns and your blacks and it will look just as fantastic. I, I feel it look just as, as fantastic, but this is the final look for number two. It looks completely different than just the black pair of jeans and the black t-shirt. So this is outfit number three. I almost forgot. So this is a sporty chic outfit. I literally bought this coat yesterday while I was at the mall shopping. I knew I wanted a green coat because I had it in my phone on the list. And I just also remembered I needed a green coat, but the coat is the stylish piece to this outfit. I still have on my black jeans and my black t-shirt because the coat has silver accessories and my purse has, it does not, it has gold anyway, <laughs> not just, okay. Let's start over. I swear there. I had silver accessories, huh? Let's go in there. Okay. Oh, well, <laughs> I thought it had silver accessories. Anyways, because my coat has silver accessories, the, the buttons are silver. I switched my belt to a black with a uh, belt with silver hardware and 
pulled out the green and the coat and paired it with my sneakers and my purse match. Of course, most of the time I don't go this matchy matchy, but I thought it really, really worked in this outfit because I have on a lot of black, the jeans in the top, but and again, I'm using the top as a top for this outfit and not an undershirt. And the jeans are my bottoms, of course, but this is a very warm, very winter fall like outfit. And it's colorful, but not too colorful. The colors are very muted, but they're really pretty and fall like. So this is look number three. Now, if you don't have a coat with all this detail in it, you can pull out any color coat and kind of use your shoes and pull out the color in the coat or use your purse to pull out the color in the coat to create a really nice fall ensemble so again this is look number three and this is how it looks so this is outfit number four and this would be my date night outfit so my jeans are always going to be my bottom so i've used a t-shirt this time as my undershirt again it's cold outside and so i want to keep warm and i've paired it with this really really sparkly pretty shirt now if you don't have something like this then you can always put a, what you feel is a really nice top on top of your t-shirt to make certain you're keeping warm but i think i purchased this one from fashion over so it was really inexpensive and I wanted again a monocrat mon <laughs> and I wanted again a mono oh my god say it monochromatic yes <laughs> and again I wanted a monochromatic look so I paired my black purse and some really pretty pointed toe black pumps with a little mesh on the side that kind of elevates it a little bit and makes it look a little dressy for date night and paired with this top I think it achieves that perfect perfect date night look it's comfortable and it's warm now if it was really cool outside I just throw another coat on top of this maybe the look wouldn't be monochromatic unless I have a black coat but knowing me I would do something a little different let's say I do have some I think a black and white coat would look really pretty with this I do have two let's see so yeah I would do this coat I think this looks really nice with this outfit it's the extra to the outfit but it's not too extra it just adds a little bit of a style element that just elevates the look that much further it makes it look that much more interesting and that much more intentional so I love this look so if it was again much colder outside I put a coat on and probably a coat like this or a solid color coat so this is my final look and again, I've made the t-shirt and undershirt under this really pretty wintry, soft winter white cream type sweater. It has a lot of detail like in the sleeves. It's nice and chunky, so it's really, really warm. I feel very comfortable in it. Again, my jeans are my bottoms and I paired the look with my Fendi purse because it matches my shoes and pulls out the brown in my shoes. Now, if you don't know anything about this brand, it's the office of Angela Scott. These are fantastic shoes. I think I call these brogues. These may have a little uh, summery type weave on the inside, but they're real leather and they're great, great quality. So they can be worn all year round. I love these shoes. They're very, very comfortable. And I think the white in the shoe and a little cream on the shoe really goes well with the sweater. And the black is a really nice contrast and pairing this bag pulls out the brown in the shoe. So I think the look is very cohesive. Even though the pants are black, I think it really, really works well together. And I love this look. I would wear this out for lunch with my friends or even a, a dinner at night or if I was just out and about not necessarily a shopping type outfit, even though it's still casual, but more of a, if I'm going out to tea or going out to a, a nice restaurant for lunch with my friends or my husband, but this is being an outfit that I will wear. Well, that's it family. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Now, don't forget, if you have not subscribed to my channel, I would really, really appreciate you doing that. It tells me and it tells YouTube that you love my content. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you'd like to be notified when my videos are uploaded every Sunday and every Thursday, you can hit that notification bell as well. Now, no matter where you are in the world, I want you to have the most blessed, blessed day. Bye-bye.